Hello! So today I wanted to share with you one of my absolute favourite looks. Ta da! This is what I call the 1940s film actress look. Or more specifically, the Lauren Bacall. That's Lauren Buck. Oh, this look is particularly smooth and sleek. I'm sure you'll agree. It's normally done with pen curls, but I think the pen curls are just a little bit fiddly and tricky. So I'm using rollers. Let me know what you think down in the comments. And please, please, please tag me in your photos on Instagram. Let's get started! Hello and welcome to the night before. You thought my hair was short, but it's actually, uh, medium length? No. It was washed and allowed to air dry the day before this. If you're a hair wash every day person, then skip the conditioner as silky hair really struggles to hold on to hair rollers. Normally in a rolling pattern, we hold the hair up here and then roll backwards or forwards, but not this time, oh no. Instead, we keep everything smooth on top, laying rollers just around the hairline. We're mimicking a classic pin curl pattern here. Much like in my Rita Hayworth tutorial, we'll be upending the rollers so we don't get an unattractive dent in the hair. The front three rollers are the only ones that will finish off still on the scalp. The others will all be dangling off. Start with the front fringe section of your hair. I'm using a 3.5cm roller for this section. I'm going to be dipping my rollers into a setting solution of Lotte Body that is uh, pretty darn strong. It's two parts water to one part Lotte Body. Yes, that, that is strong. I'm trying to stick my hair together. Take that roller, dip it in, brush up the sides of your hair section to get them damp, roll backwards away from your face, like so. All other sections will be rolled in the opposite direction towards your face. Make sure you tuck in those mischievous ends. For the front section opposite your parting, you'll also be taking hair from the top of your head. The next section will be on the same side as your parting. Take about as much hair as would fit into an inch of scalp squared, but in a line just behind the front roller. Does that make sense? Hold on. Okay, let's put that on screen. Roll from the bottom, curling the hair in towards the face. Stop when the top of your roller is just below your hairline. Now that roller is in place, begin to section off the rest of your hair. If you don't have a big hair clip to hand, then use this nifty little trick and just clip it with a roller. This is about how much hair you want in your underlayer. Again, roll towards your face, from the bottom to the top, starting just below the hairline so it looks like you have crazy earrings. Take down your top layer and give it a quick brush. Now divide and conquer. Remember to stop each roller at the same level as the ones already on your head. You can tuck them down ever so slightly to make sure they're in line. Lauren Bacall trivia. An overnight sensation in her first film, To Have and Have Not. She was dubbed The Look, but really was the whole package. Sultry looks, husky voice and a brash attitude. One of the most independent women on screen. Nevertheless, at 19 she fell in love with her very first co-star. 45-year-old Humphrey Bogart, and they married a year later. After 12 years of marriage, he died from cancer and she remarried briefly, but since her new husband nicknamed her the Widow Bogart, you can probably see why it didn't work out. We're done! It's party time! I'm doing. I just like this look. 
Good morning, looking much brighter today. Still dancing though. Time to take out those rollers. First thing you're going to do, other than shake it off, baby, is break up those curls with your fingers until it looks like you have a giant puffball on your head. Next up, grab the bristle brush and go to town. falling down. Mm. I use the Kent Brushes PF07 Oval Cuddle Pure Bristle Brush, which is a mouthful. To shake it all around, start brushing through the comb. This is going to calm the curls down and help them be a little bit more regulated. Before we go any further, we're going to add a little height to this middle section with some back combing. Add a handy pot of pomade, attempt to take your rings off even though you've already put them on your fingers and rub through your hair. more to the ends. Delightful. Then comb through. And back to brushing. Yeah, there's a lot of brushing. Once you're happy, it's time to spray, spray, spray. Try not to choke yourself to death. Here it is, the finished look. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, then please give it a thumbs up and share with your friends. Working until the last year of her life, Paul aged very gracefully, declaring in her down-to-earth way, I think your whole life shows in your face and you should be proud of that. <laughs>